to the another aspect of preparation that is your verbal ability and verbal ability is one of the integral part of your cat preparation you can't ignore it you can't ignore it many of the students are not getting success in cat because they are weak in verbal don't ignore verbal don't think of kar lenge kabhi bhi this is this preparation you must start very initially quant you can make up after one month also but verbal once you are losing the time you will not get time to make up or you will not get time for improvement what is verbal ability just i will try to explain in little uh, very basic way any thoughts are coming in your mind or any person mind that thoughts will be very raw way it, you can say it will be raw format just a raw material because it will be without dress or without makeup i am not comparing with ladies or dress or makeup just i am telling any thoughts that it has come india will become super power in 2025 this is one thought now this thought how to understand and how to make it india will become uh, super power in 2025 you have to dress up this thought you make the proper dress you have to make proper makeup then only this thought will convert into a understandable language what is needed language will make the role of dress of thought like if you know the story of the story of vivekananda then vivekananda was having the language and his guru was not having language but thought then vivekananda has delivered the language whatever his guru has thought there vivekananda role was to provide the language and vivekananda many of the times he has accepted whenever i am speaking at any 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 manch or any 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 places always my guru will be behind me i am realizing he is just standing behind me and he is telling me this this is the thought and you are speak it it was the realizes because his guru was not having good language but he was a great thought he was a great thinker this language will make the great role to make the dress up of thoughts you can't ignore the role of language and language you can say if you are thinking it is a dress then fabric of dress is vocabulary fabric of dress is vocabulary if without 200 to 300 one common thing i am telling this is one common proven point many of the universities has done the research on that any of the kids or any of the any of the person if he, they don't have 200 to 300 vocabulary for any of the language he will not able to speak fluently that language any of the language either you are hindi marathi tamil whatever you know french urdu but minimum 200 to 300 vocabulary is needed what is your mother tongue you might be knowing more than 200 to 300 because just tacit way in direct way you are keep on listening from since beginning then you are able to memorize you are able to learn but any of the language if it is new to you then acquiring minimum 200 to 300 words or 300 vocabulary it is a minimum to make the minimum flow for speaking minimum flow of communications communication is one of the biggest thing you have to develop generally we are, we are having one of kind of misconception communication we are thinking only in india especially like hard work smart work like so many buzz words confusion is the same way communication we are thinking only speaking english no this is one small part very tiniest part of communication that is speaking english spoken english is one of the part but communication is having very wide sense how it will come fabric of dress is vocabulary how to develop vocabulary without good vocabulary you can't become a good reader you can't become a uh, you can't understand any language properly just we'll explore little bit more now question is how to build a good, good vocabulary old method is there like maybe many of the school or many of the institutions or many of the society are following to make the good vocabulary oxford dictionary purchase karo daily usko padho ratta maro just memorize keep on memorize keep on memorize that will give you the stock pile of your vocabulary but it will not open the way how to communicate how to start speaking how to understand understand uh, the language how to listen the thing only speaking is not sufficient for communication and due to after your cat result your second round they are checking your communication in different different way 
they are checking through listening they are checking through writing they are checking through speaking this is having very broad broad uh, scope of communication one workshop i will take and that workshop will be really really interesting i will discuss only related to communications and how to develop it first there are total six facets of communications are there and all six facets you have to develop to become a good and successful manager or good person decent person i will discuss it will start with the observation and it will go up to writing writing is the top most communication channel method one is reading whatever i used to recommend you daily reading you must read that is your level one reading whatever i i am sending you the pdf that is your level one reading newspaper and magazines list of newspaper magazines also there slowly slowly i will guide you how to select first time providing you pdf pdf will continue and uh, i will give you the list of newspaper magazine if you want you can read further also level 2 reading is reading of novels and books that will, i will guide you and i will send you once level 1 will become a daily habits then only i will start level 2 method 1 is reading that of course to gain the good vocabulary you must be a voracious reader that is one of the way another technical way most of the people are here technical background another technical way learn vocab based on the three broad parameter what is this uh bro uh, three broad parameter i will discuss in next workshop mostly i will discuss about the vocabulary in detail one hour one and a half hour and it will be so interesting session then uh, next next sunday you must be ready for next workshop it will it will be like eye opener how to develop develop a good vocabulary through method 2 also we are following method 1 we will start to follow method 2 also and within 3 to 5 month or maximum you can you can keep the limit 6 month you will able to develop around 5k to 7k vocabulary 5000 to 7000 vocabulary very easily and working vocabulary means which you are able to use at ready stage at any point of time it will be minimum 1k and if you have ready made vocabulary means ready vocabulary which are very easy to use if it is 1000 you will become a one of the good speaker you are not believing i am telling you you will become a good speaker if you have in your working working memory 1000 vocabulary if you are able to use very properly generally we are using 400 to 500 vocabulary to communicate at any any places except sasi tharur he will use so many complex 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 words i will share you few few of things i am i am really fan of him i used to i used to hear all of his lecture whatever he has given in different different university or in lok sabha because he is using very fine quality of vocabulary if you want to want to uh, want to hear any of the person from india then one of the person is sasi tharur i am not telling only sasi tharur so many persons are there but sasi tharur lecture you must hear you will you it is eye opener how much difficult difficult vocab he is keeping in his working memory then 1k if you have working memory then you will become one of the finest speaker and uh, if you are a, if you are a good speaker your life will become easy your life will become easy because once you want to grow in life communication only will give you the way to grow just to go in any of the company who are working or who are inspired to join any of the company what they are doing vice president president and c c band of officer they are doing communications different way very logical way communication having different channels who are doing lower management people they are keep on working on computer skill is only 20% if you are very skilled people that is 20% that is not going to uplift you you will become a good worker 80% will and will will come from communications all top people will do the communications they are getting high package they are getting very fat salary only because they are able to communicate in better way then uh, this will give you focus on method 2 how to develop little bit more about vocabulary how different people are uh, telling about the vocabulary teaching vocabulary list is inefficient if i will give you together one list you can find now this is the era content is not a issue when i was preparing for cat i was preparing for other competitive exam that time content was one of the biggest challenge i was not getting easily you will not believe many of the things i i was uh, i was uh, i was taking from as a courier from delhi it was not available in bangalore 
it was not available in Bangalore. No Google Baba was there. Now Google Baba is solving your all of the problem. Internet has made content very easy. Then content is not a easy, not a issue. If you want a list, you will get millions of lists. You will go to the Google. But all these are, all these are going to help you. No, the time is better spent reading alone. This is going to help you. This is just a collection of content. You can do it. It is one of the satisfaction. Everybody having there in laptop, like uh, you can say 100 GB, 200 GB data. Hardly 1 GB data also they are not using for for the, uh, they are not using purposely or purposefully. All will be just a satisfaction. I had this much data, this much collection. So many film collections, so many song collections, so many content collections. How much we are using? Just type on Google that uh, vocabulary list you will get millions of results. You download, keep on download. It is not going to help. Content is not a now issue. Issue is which content is good and how to use that content. That guidance is now issue. Content is abundant. This is creating one kind of confusion also. Which content is good, which content is bad. How to use it, how to select it. Now, another quotation related to vocabulary. Vocabulary enables us to interpret and to express. If you have a limited vocabulary, you will also have a limited vision and limited future. If you want to broaden your future, you must increase your working vocabulary. Maybe right now, maybe 100 or 200, you keep on increase. If daily one or two vocabulary, if you are not adding in your working, working memory, then you can think your day is not finished. You can make one challenge with yourself daily minimum one or two vocabulary we have to add in my working memory. Next is don't underestimate the seductive power of a decent vocabulary. What is making difference? Just I will write. I have written few words, few vocabulary. All are related to same situations. Drizzle, what is? When you can say very less intensive rain is there, we are we call it is a drizzle, drizzling. If जिसको बोलते हैं हिंदी में क्या बोलते हैं? छीटे पर रहे हैं, फुहारे पर रहे हैं, that is drizzle. Rain last, pounded. When rain is very intense, pounded means it is beating, beating the floor. Rain last, heavy rain, very intense rain, torrential rain, sudden very torrential rain. You can you can just remember the Kedarnath. When Kedarnath recently also happened in 2013. What happened? Torrential rain. Next is rain, cat and dog. If heavy rain continued for a certain period of time, rain, cat and dog. Incessant rain, relentless rain, intermittent rain. All are related to rain and almost more than 100, 200 vocabulary are there which are related to rain. If you are interested, you just search on Google about the Kedarnath and you read one article related to Kedarnath. This is ideal way to ideal way to learn the vocab related to rain. Almost all vocabulary, whatever can be possible, you will be able to learn if you are reading related to Kedarnath. And from here, one of the understanding will come how to report, how to do reporting. Like any of the anchor or any of the uh, news person are making report, how to do the reporting. Okay, I will teach you. This is again interesting area. You will enjoy, really enjoy it. How to, what is the role of reporter and how to make a report, how to do the reporting, which type of uh, tense we have to use, which type of vocabulary we should use. This will use in your report. Again, flooded, deluged. These all we can be used in indirect way also. It is deluged, deluged of work. Deluged of work means overloaded work. We didn't get time to do anything. Inundated work, drenched, fully, fully, you can say, fully wet. If you have gone outside and suddenly rain has come, you have not got the time to stop your vehicle or something. You fully drenched, fully wet, devastated, landslide, mudslide. These are the effect of rain, effect of rain. If heavy rain is there, then what will happen? It will devastate the Kedarnath. It was devastated the Kedarnath. Landslide everywhere, landslide was there, mudslide was there, all power line was snipped off and life has become, life has become very difficult. Okay? Now, just I will conclude with this thing and I will give you the idea and this same idea I will just carry forward 
for the next workshop and I will discuss very detailed related to vocabulary and you 100% I am sure you will enjoy it. How much you are enjoying for quant session, DI session, more than that. Rain, water flowing from a sky to earth. This is one of the activity. How we'll develop this method too for vocabulary. Just I am giving you idea. Next workshop, I will just dig out in detail. And you know, I will dig out in very mathematical and technical way. This is activity. Water flowing from a sky to earth that is called rain. Correct? I will just extend this idea, this activity. Meaning is movement of water is happening. Movement of water is happening. Movement of water can happen on earth's surface also. It can happen from sky to earth also. It can happen to human body also. It can happen to non-living thing also. It can happen to soil also. It can happen to inside earth also. All things are movement of water. Now just try to visualize, just extend, stretch your imagination. If you are able to see all kind of movement of water together, are you able to assemble all the vocab together or not? You will be. You will be. Just you think technically. Movement of water. What can be? Movement of water from a sky to earth. It is a rain related to rain. This, this, this. Movement of water on the earth. It is a river flowing or so many things are there. I will discuss. Movement of water in human body. Urine and if we are drinking the water. Sweating is one of the movement of the water from inside to outside the body. Soil, if it is going inside, inside the earth, what is the movement of water? Drinking water, generally we are uh, taking from earth because it will be purified. It will keep on move from top surface to inner core surface, surface and water will become fully purified and we are taking out through borewell or something. This is movement of water. Movement of water. Movement of water in sea. These all are one category, one activity that is movement of water. If you will try to learn based on the activity, then it is very easy, hardly 50 to 60 activity. It is enough to develop enough vocabulary which is required for your cat, which is required to become a good manager also. We have to learn, but we are learning the vocabulary single, single way. That is big. That is big, biggest drawback. In learning procedure itself, biggest drawback. We, we will learn the vocabulary based on the activity. And again, I will just explain about the activity also which type of activity and uh, activity again it will be based on their uh, you can say uh, their uh, physical presence after then their cause and effect these all will be their features means this activity just will explain based on the features and based on that features will try to assemble the word together and it will be easy to connect because we will put in memory we will put in brain similar way how brain is perceiving it brain will work like a one of the one of the point like if one nail you are putting in the wall you will able to hang plenty of thing if nail is not there you will not able to hang a single thing if one nail is there through one nail you can hang 10 nails and 10 nails you can hang 100 nails and every nail you can put something work with that is called peg theory how brain works how does brain works that is one of the pegs theory how we have to put the pegs then we will put the pegs in the form of activity in the form of different features. And one activity, one nail, one pegs, we will able to hang thousands of things. It will be stable because brain will accept it. I am doing similar way how brain is taking the things. If we are not going against that. If we are using single single vocabulary, it is against the brain. Against the software of brain, it will not accept. It will go random where here, there. If we want to reconnect, you will not get any logic to connect. Brain need logic in the form of images, in the form of a structure. What we are doing based on the pegs? We are making a structure. Because brain will not understand another thing. Image and a structure. Only these two things brain will understand. Then through pegs, we are making a structure and we are putting all the vocabs in the form of images. 